everybody. Welcome back to another episode of What She Said right here on RedMediaRadio.com. And if you're viewing us, then you're viewing the podcast on YouTube. Still What She Said, just the podcast. And I'm your host, Latif. I'm the owner of Anaj Health and Beauty. And you can find me on Facebook at INOJ Health and Beauty. That's also where you can find What She Said, the card game. The card game for a woman, about woman, invented by a woman. It is the official Ladies Night card game. And also, we have our uh, lovely co-host, Miss Janisa, co-owner of Student Apparel. Hey, you can find Student on Google, social media, search Student Apparel, and at www.stuenxproducts.com. All right. And ladies, I hope that you've been enjoying uh, what she said with our uh, guest co-hosts, learning a little bit more about them, as well as discussing some female topics so you know keep it locked we'll have lots of that but we're also going to still have me and Janisa so this week you have me and Janisa on what she said and tonight's topic is I can only be me I can only be me and life sometimes I feel like uh we expect other people to behave or react the way we would behave or react and we have to realize that they can only be who they are um I think that self-work, this whole new trend of evolving and blah, 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 and all this and that, which I'm a firm believer in. But at the end of the day, we still have some things that just makes us who we are, makes us those unique individuals. And we go through all this work to try to be sometimes something that we're not. So as I always say, balance. It's all about balance. And we have to also remind ourselves that, hey, I can only be me. It's, you know, I can work on some things, but some things it's just me so janisa let's go and start on with the women oh boy mm. <laughs> with the women i can only be me uh being straightforward I, I i don't i don't see any other way to be with the ladies hey if i'm your friend if i'm your family whoever whoever you are to me my daughters my stepdaughter my my granddaughter i'm i'm gonna just i'm gonna keep it straight with you <laughs> what she said I was about to say, what she said, if the relationship is close. If it ain't too close, then, um, yeah, I'm not going to be accused of being, uh, whatever, hater, shade, whatever, whatever the words is that people use when they don't like what you say. <laughs> I'm not going to be accused of that. Um, I'm going to say, I can only be me with the women, um, uh, being too ladylike. I've tried it. And it lasts about a whole total of 10 minutes. <laughs> a whole total of 10 minutes. And I'm like, you know what? I can only be me. I'm, I do super great at teaching my young, my daughters how to be ladylike and stuff. You would probably think when certain people haven't met me yet and met them, they would probably think that this dainty little mom is going to come in and they probably, I'm good at telling them, but when it comes to me, <laughs> yeah, I'm a little crusty around the edges like the bread. I'm, you know, it's just... <laughs> what she said. <laughs> Not crusty around the edges. <laughs> I'm, you know. <laughs> <laughs> all right, that was a good one. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely rough around the edges. It's all good, though. <laughs> hey, just... <laughs> oh, you can only be who you are, shoot. Uh -huh. Every uh, look, all of all of us are meant to be, you know, just all the time. Like, girl, how do you look so good all of the time? Yeah. I, don't even, I don't even understand it. Like, oh man, I can't. I'm I'm with you on that one because what she said. Because um, yeah, I struggle <laughs> <laughs> sometimes. I mean, you know, sometimes I, I definitely can get, you know, I can get up there, but yeah. I, it's not I can't do every day I'm looking like this <laughs> yeah you're not gonna see me every day if you see me every day it's, I don't look like this every day <laughs> <laughs> what she said no. mm -mm. um let me see I can only be me with the ladies um uh being a being the type of friend that I am I, I can only be me I, I can't I can't call you every day, all day. Um, we can't hang out every weekend. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, I, I can only be me. I'm that friend. I, I, I'll definitely check on you every now and again. You're always in my heart. 
anybody, anybody I care about. Trust me, I, I think about you more than I check on you. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so, you know, just know I'm always thinking about, you know, the people I care about. Oh, what but. she said, definitely. Oh, definitely. Um, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I agree with that. I'll piggyback off of that. I'll only be me. If I say I'm going to call you back and I don't call you back, and I'm mean, I've, I've come across this, and I'm like, okay, so either people are really, it's some people who have maybe some issues that they don't know they have, or they, you know, lack empathy or whatever, but, oh, yeah, I've definitely been in a position where I may have been in a text thread with somebody, and I go dark. Or I say I'm gonna call them back, and then when I call them back, you ain't never called. You said it's like <laughs> you 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 know how many children I have, right? Mm-hmm. You know me enough to know how many children I have. To say the least, you know me enough to know that I have a baby. <laughs> so if I stop texting, and if it's like on Facebook or something, and you see I'm active, you do know that it's a possibility I probably ran away from my computer. Because there's a lot that goes on behind the scenes. I have little children that like to play Roblox and they use my phone and you know, <laughs> you know, so like they may have the phone and the computer may be on. Baby took a big, huge dump. Like, you know, if you want TMI, I can give you TMI. I can give you the whole day of how it all went down. You know, but that's why I didn't answer you back. And then if I come back to you and say, oh, hey, sorry, you know, I, I went to sleep or dozed off. Doesn't mean that in your head you have to visualize that I just literally just clapped out. No, I probably got tied up with the baby and then went to sleep and then got back to you, you know. But it's like, yeah, I've definitely come across where people just, oh, I ain't gonna answer it. It's like, wow. So, yeah, I, yeah, your life must be jolly. <laughs> your life must be real jolly because <laughs> what she said, like the understanding person, <laughs> <laughs> right. Yeah, no, nah, you can't take it personal when when people like I know I'm I'm ooh, I I might I might call you, I'm go from call I, if I say I'll call you back, it might be from an hour to it could be three months later. Yeah. <laughs> like, like you said, it's not it's not personal. Uh, please we, we cannot take it personal. But I, the people I know, because I, I have people, friends who I'll call you back. I, they might I, we might not talk again for a while but mm-hmm. i don't take it personal because i understand they have jobs they have right. family they have lives shoot you it's it's so much going on sometimes you get so caught up i know i sometimes i get so caught up by the time i think about calling somebody back it's like 10 30 at night and i'm like i'm not calling anybody at 10 30 right. unless it's an emergency you don't I don't, you just don't call people that late. You know, right. that, that, that's how I, I was brought up. Like, you just, you don't call people, especially married people, yes. engaged people, in a relationship, like anybody, kids, you just you just don't call somebody's house right. after a certain time. So, I, a lot of times, I, like I said, by the time I get that moment, it's 10, 30, 11 o'clock, you know? And I ain't called. Then the next day, here we go again. <laughs> so, she said, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you have businesses like yeah. that. Shoot, houses to take care of. Like, you know what I mean? Like we have it's all kinds of stuff going on. You know, right? And you have little ones, so what she said. I, I remember those days, but you you can't be sitting up on the phone with no baby. <laughs> yes, <laughs> with baby. you can't. <laughs> no, what? Like she, no, it ain't gonna happen. And they all be all silent and stuff. Like, come on, women. When you on the phone with your girl and her baby in the background, you all annoyed and you all <laughs> mad and silent. Like, are you like, look, I ain't got, I, yo, that, I just be like, yo, like, what is wrong with you? Why? Yeah. I could be on the phone with somebody and tears in the background. I'm still running my mouth. <laughs> what she said? I'm going to head up because I know you're still listening. It's just that baby. Like, right. You and that's what they do. Shoot, my adult, my I have adult children in my house on a regular basis. I guess I have, I have my stepkids, I have my grand, my granddaughter, and then oh man, I'm so excited for the new baby. Yeah. <laughs> but, <laughs> they, but even my grown kids, I I be doing stuff. They, mom, I need this. Yes, you know what I mean. Did. They come interrupt my conversation and start just started talking to me like they still do the same things they did when they were little kids but you know they see you on the phone but they just still they just start talking right and this is levels to it you know sometimes it's like you know you know i'm on this phone and sometimes it's like huh baby what you said like it's not right but sometimes i get those people on the other line and it's just like you can just feel the attitude it's like oh, God, <laughs> right damn. like oh my god yeah that's why i love talking to my best friend on the phone we don't talk a lot but 
It'd be all kinds of stuff going in the background. She'd be like, what's going on? What they say, hi, like laughing and stuff. Like we're all engaging. Like, you know, she's putting her, she understands. Like, this is why we're best friends. We understand each other. Yeah, we can do anything <laughs> on the phone with the other one. Nobody's getting upset. Nobody's saying, I'll call you back. I see you busy. Um, you right. didn't hear what I said and all that. Like, oh, you are killing the energy. <laughs> <laughs> what she said. Yeah. People like that just kill the energy. Uh, right, like man. you ain't they ain't get enough attention as a kid. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's, that's the only thing that I, that I could think of because as a grown up, like you have to understand, like you said, that's you sometimes you just have to be a part of the conversation. Right. <laughs> <laughs> <Sometimes> you, just, <laughs> you jumping in and you're too sad. Right. Like, oh, oh nobody was talking to me. I'm sorry. Like <laughs> there she said. What you said, girl? We be doing all kinds of random stuff when I'm on the phone with her. If I'm on Messenger, I put her on the face. Oh, you put me on the camera. Oh shit. <laughs> we be having a ball. <laughs> <laughs> uh, like, you know, it's like it's not even that big of a deal. Live, breathe. Hey, girl. <laughs> yes, Let it go. <laughs> <laughs> what else you got for the women? Um. Um, I can only be me. I'm going to let you know if you don't look right. I'm trying to think what she said, but this sometimes, like I said, <laughs> depending on the person. No. Yeah, but the, no, that, right, exactly. That, <laughs> depending on the person, not just anybody. Um, shoot, my granddaughter, <laughs> my baby, oh gosh, my baby. She, kids are so funny, but I loved it. My grandbaby let me know grandma's mouth was not smelling too good. <laughs> <laughs> She let me know. <laughs> and I said, that's what's up, baby. You can only be you. Yeah. That's what's up. I'm glad you said something to me because I'm all in your face. What she said? And she was so sweet about it. She said, you know, Grandma, I don't, I don't want to be mean or I don't want to be Yeah. <laughs> I said, good job, baby. I gave her a hug. I'm like, I'm so great. I almost shed a tear. I'm so proud of you, girl. You don't let me know. <laughs> <laughs> what you right. Let, let 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 your friend know. Let your grandma, your your whoever, mm -hmm. <laughs> let, let them know. Mm, don't what have me did? all the people's faces, and I, I my mouth ain't right, <laughs> girl. Look, I was about to say what she said, but my three year old shady, cause she does it <laughs> when I just get out of the shower. Oh, you need to go take a bath. I'm like, girl, bye. Like, cause I'm no good. Uh, like, I don't even have no. I'm, I don't have bo problems if i did i would say it right here on what she said yes i would but no i don't thank god i don't you know i eat kind of clean i'm gonna have be, she be being shady i'm gonna give her a gift oh you need to take a shot oh you need to get in the bath like i'm like wow you you one of those because you know i just got out the sh you know i just got out the shower okay you know i didn't get my like no don't do that Gia. like she's such a diva <laughs> You checking people out what they wear. You up there like always checking somebody out. Girl. Oh, that's funny. Like, <laughs> girl, bye. Get out of here. <laughs> but on that note, we're going to take a quick break. And I guess this, we'll just lead it on into the children since we ended this one with the children. With I Can Only Be Me right here on Red Media. Well, I Can Only Be Me on what she said right here on RedMediaRadio.com. <laughs> All right, we're back. I keep disappearing for the podcast, people. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I can only be me. I'm yeah. I'm just quirky. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> but <laughs> we're talking about the children now and the things that you know. I can I can only be me, or they can only be them. Go ahead, Janisa. Ooh, boy. Um. Hmm. Oh, let me see. Kids, kids, kids. It's so it's so much with the kids, cause boy. Um, shoot, they can only be them being shady. Let, let's let's go back to <laughs> <laughs> what she said. So, so I'm on marches, you know. You some of those kids, some kids, boys, should be shady, <laughs> <laughs> but they are funny and cute with it sometimes. Um, 
one of my nephews when he was little um i was getting dressed like going somewhere i don't know even know where i'm going he was like oh who you trying to look cute for i'm like <laughs> And he was three at the time. I'm like, oh, excuse me. Like, what you mean? <laughs> like, what you, uh, what do you know about somebody trying to be cute, number one? Like, what, what do you know about that? You right. Know? But it was cute because, so, you know, kids can only be them. Just just that honesty, that, that little the little shady moments that they throw out. Uh, they, don't even know, they don't even know it's shady. Usually they're just imitating what they see somebody else do, you know. But, uh-huh. You, I'm like, look, I, myself, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right? Like, what you trying to say about me the other times? But you know what I mean? I'm like, well, hmm, what, do, what do I normally look like? <laughs> <laughs> I'm, a, I know what I normally look like. One time I went to the store, like by my house. Uh-huh. And, um, I told you I go to the store, hair tied up. I, I'm just going in and out. I don't really care. I went in there one day with my hair out. The lady was like, oh, shoot. I almost didn't recognize you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but that's what's up. Because that's how I like it. I don't want you to know what I look like all the time. No, she said. <laughs> no, well, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> I don't be giving a fuck. I think, I think that when I say that, I think people be thinking, like, nah, she right here. No, nah, I really don't give a fuck. Like, I, I don't you know about no, like, what nobody thinks because I know I am. I know I'm a good person. Like, so that leans on you. But that's a whole different topic. Um, <laughs> But I can only be me with that. I can't sit here and, like, you know, when people question motives or think that I ain't got, like, well, I don't know what to tell you. I really don't. Like, what you said. I don't know what to tell you. I'm trying to be old. I'm trying to live. I'm trying to be that 105 year old that still got her senses and <laughs> dropping jewels. Like, no, for real. I'm not. I ain't trying to have no crazy karma come my way because I was like, no, I'm just not. But uh, let me see with the children. All right, this is specifically for my children, and y'all better be tuned in. <laughs> I can only be me, period. I can only be me. I, I can only be me in the morning. Like, it's been times I'll be looking at my fritro. Like, I'll see this book. I might say one of my stupid, I don't know, jokes or something or say something. And she'd be all, you know, she's so studious and so well put together. And I could see, like, a look across her face. I'm like, dang, I'm getting on your nerves. And I'm like, let me try to tone it down. Then the next morning, I come back out with the same hype. I'm like, okay, Monty, I can only be me, Monty. Damn. <laughs> like, I don't know what you want me to like, I don't know. Like, you're you because of me. Like, I can only be me. Uh, same thing, you know, my son. Like, you know, like, he chose, like, I ain't gonna say he chose violence, but he chose something with me and him. Some kind of awkward something, but, you know, like, you know, like, all of a sudden, like, what's up with your attitude? Like, I go back in the room, why you got an attitude? Oh, you need to fix that. Like, you know, like, I find myself giving him vague threats. Like, oh, you about to bring a side of me. You know, like, you about to bring some street side of me that I didn't even know I really like. Where's Is this what you want to do, son? Like, <laughs> you got Where's no she? attitude these days. I don't know what I did. I ain't did nothing to you. I don't know what to tell you. I can only be me, though. I am going to worry about you. I'm going to call you. I'm going to send you random texts. I'm going to say random stuff to you on the text like, yo, I just had a feeling like you watching yourself. You what come back with an ad, why, mom, why you had to call me? Why you this, that, why you, you know, like, it's like you chose some kind of awkwardness between us and it's about to go down. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to tell you I can only be me. I don't, <laughs> what you know, the little ones, they want to be all, look, I'm just ran. I'm sorry, people, but you know, the little ones, they, <laughs> you hurt my feelings. You love them more. I'm like, look, I can look now. <laughs> you're trying to be me. You sitting here like you want me to be all Mary Poppinish. I'm not Mary Poppinish all the time. <laughs> you two going to dance. You know I'm down with that. But you know all this like no. Like I, mwah, I gave you a kiss. I gave you a hug. I don't know what else you want. Like <laughs> I didn't gave you cereal three times today. What more do you like? What she said. Like, what for me? <laughs> <laughs> like they know I'm not the model mom. Y'all, you know this. You you knew this. You knew this since you was able to comprehend. Now you want me? No. <laughs> <laughs> what she said. Ooh, that felt good. <laughs> That's what's up. Getting <laughs> you know, on my nerves. What me? Uh, shit. <laughs> 
what she said yes you can only be you right yes. like, i feel you i would to piggyback off of that i can only be me i'm i'm a shit talking mom <laughs> um, I, I might who knows i might do a random dance or break out in a song when i'm talking <laughs> to you you know what i mean who knows like i can only be me that's it that's Yes, like you say, you the Dale threat. <laughs> <laughs> I can only be you don't look. Hey, you don't know me. You don't know me the way you think you do. Yeah, like what? Like you think you gangster, it, <laughs> boy? <laughs> Where you think you got it from? Like for real, if I want to your whole body. Don't make me roll up. I, I chill with you and your homies. Don't like <laughs> there ain't nothing new. But I, I like being home. <laughs> I like being home. <laughs> What she said. But I can roll with y'all. Trust me. You ain't trust me. Like <laughs> they don't know. They don't, they don't know. know. Cause we we'll always tell them, you know, like you don't even understand. You don't even understand the people I, I I've known in life, the the places I've been, the people I've hung around. Cause we don't tell them. We want to keep that stuff from them, so they don't know. Hey, oh, they don't even be getting the hint. Like I'm gonna say, my hint. I hope they listen to my hint when I say that random fuck. Fuck! <laughs> they, you post it back up, but you don't. <laughs> it's just random, like they. Like, once they get that point, that random fuck, like y'all still going, like you heard it, you heard that word. That means back, the, back up. Leave me alone. <laughs> but they don't. <laughs> what she said? Yeah. <laughs> like what the hell? I have to get my spoon out. <laughs> yeah, I think they they just see us as mom and. They see, cause we want to be a, a, you know, at least I at least want to be a decent example. I, I'm not trying to be perfect. I ain't trying to be spectacular, but I, I at least want to be a decent example mm-hmm. for my, for my, you know, all of the children in my life. But yeah, I feel you. They don't know. <laughs> that, that's all they see. So they think, oh, she, she, she probably ain't never done anything. Yeah. Oh, mom, mom's so sweet and nice and. Oh, uh, she's probably green, and she don't know. Like, uh-huh. man. <laughs> you don't <Girl>. know. <laughs> like, yeah, right. What she said, like, they really don't know. Like, why are you out here trying to get me arrested at forty two? <laughs> hmm. What like, she said? Too old. Like, too old. My son always trying. I got this. I can handle it. Cause you just, you know, like one time he told me at the get, oh, you saying regular stuff, regular stuff. Like I'm trying to talk sense like an adult. So what was I? Like you wanted me out here on some gangster? Like what was he supposed to be blasting <laughs> little dirt and you know letting them know what we about? Like you want me to get out here and really like go back? Like you right? Know? <laughs> you want me to turn into Keisha? You know, like <laughs> I got the babies in the car. Right, you yeah, look. You're trying to be low key. Like, look, I'm trying to be low key. I'm trying to be at least a good mom. Try to show you how you <laughs> how you respond to people in public, and you want me to just go ahead and go. <laughs> yeah. Say <Like>, what? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I said it all. My name is not Queen Latifah. <laughs> <laughs> what she said, right? <laughs> Oh my god, what else you got for the children? Um, for the children. Uh, I can only be me. I like to, t- I told you I like to tell little kids like random stuff. I love it so. I just like to tell them little lies for no reason. <laughs> <laughs> I do. Especially like when they're a certain age and you know they believe everything you say. Mm-hmm. I just say, I just say some wild stuff. Oh man. Oh God, I'm here. Okay. I don't know what's going on. Sorry, I'm listening. I disappeared. Podcast. Oh. <laughs> I disappeared. <laughs> oh, yeah, what she said. I um, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. I, I I go into like just characters, and they just be looking. It's so my five year old be yeah, I be acting like a whole different person. No, <laughs> my crush up, oh, messing it up. <laughs> <laughs> You know, good and right. goddamn well. My name ain't Lazy Lucy or whatever name I didn't decide. Right. What she <laughs> said. I said that when they get too serious, when you like, come on, man, stop, <laughs> like, stop. Or they start like, telling people, start <laughs> believing it. Cause I, so y'all have a tendency to forget what I say. So they just been walking around with stuff for years. Uh-huh. Damn, I'm like, oh shoot, I forgot I told you that. <laughs> 
Ah, she said, I'm not supposed to put a joke I can only make. Um, I mean, I think that rant just summed it up. Like, <laughs> but you know, like, the, 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 uh, I mean, you know, my sons, they not here no more. Well, just one. But they used to get mad because I always had these rules when I left the house. Nobody get in the shower. Don't eat no oh, chicken yeah. and don't eat no peanut butter and jelly. Matter of fact, just eat everything now while I'm here. You know, like just eat. That way I ain't got to worry about it. You know, I, you know, my daughter laughed because I'm like, come on, you know, I do the Heimlich. She's like, no, oh, whatever. Yeah, I'm like, here, let me show you. And I'm like doing the Heimlich on her and she like laughing. I'm like, yo, you can't laugh. Like, this is serious. Like, you know, like I'm, I'm being warned, but for some reason they don't take me serious. Like, mom, go, like, go, you know. But now I got the camera so I can zoom on the camera. Like, why are you eating? I told you I'll be right back. Don't eat. <laughs> <laughs> now I got to sit on the camera and watch you chew. <laughs> Even though you're 21 years old. Because <laughs> you would never stop worrying about them. Like, they never. Never. You, you let them go to to a certain extent. But I'm still, like you said, if I'm watching you eat something that you could possibly choke on, I'm like... <laughs> Even when I'm I'm walking with my I was walking with my oldest daughter, she's about to be twenty six. Uh, I, I slid her right onto the inside of the, the, the inside. I still do that with my kids. Oh I still, yeah. I still walk on the outside. I mean not if like if, if my husband is with yeah, us. Of course, right. you know. But if it's me and them, I still I, they're grown in there, I still take them and just <laughs> what she said. <laughs> What she said, it's our baby. Come on, baby. I know, I know. I told, I said, no, you grown. Look, she, she's a mom herself. Like, <laughs> what she said, though. No, your baby gonna always be your baby. Yeah, and they utilize that too. They, they utilize it. <laughs> Those grown ones, yes, they do. Oh my God, don't even, girl. The stuff they be thinking, I'm like, y'all think, I'm like, damn. I know I'm magical to you, but I ain't magical to everybody. I know I'm magical, but that mean everybody gotta know I'm like. I don't mean they recognize me, but thank you for recognizing my magic. But nah, I can't help you out with that one, boy. <laughs> what she said, yeah. Can't help you out. Sorry. <laughs> right. All right. Well, we're going to come back and we're going to talk about the men. We went in on them children. Damn. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <We went in. laughs> but this is what she said right here on redmediaradio.com. Be right back. You cannot be a believer until you see your old life and the misery thereof and and one day. You will find true success and happiness if you have only one goal. There really is only one, and that is this. To fulfill the highest, most truthful expression of yourself as a human being. You want to max out your humanity by using your energy to lift yourself up, your family, and the people around you. Theologian Howard Thurman said it best. He said, don't ask yourself what the world needs. Ask yourself what makes you come alive and then go do that. Because what the world needs is people who have come alive. All right. (laughs) <laughs> the finale <laughs> we are talking about situations where we can only be who we are and please be who you are also uh you know I, I think i'm i think i'm pretty good with accepting people who we are and i don't mean that in a negative way i mean just understand that just like i have crazy feelings and i feel like you know my feelings and i'm sure you too you know like how you feel about life and stuff that everybody won't get it and it's the same thing that we don't understand. You know, well, we may say somebody's being that having that. Shoot, I call you know the the owner of this station an asshole several times, and then I say, <laughs> no, he's only being him. But because we're in a relationship, then you know, <laughs> sometimes we do that to our man. So you know, that's just what it is. Yeah. Only, only being them, and it makes life a lot easier when you accept people for who they are. Not the negative aspect, but just like, you know what? They're being who they are. Thank God that they're living, you know? Could be worse, so. What she said. Gotta accept people. That's what makes life fun. But, Denise, let's talk about the men. I already <laughs> went in a little bit. 
Uh, right. Um, let me see. I can only be me when I check you when you are wrong. Oh yes, what she said. I can. Only, I'm, and I'm not gonna stop. I feel like this. If you really care about the person you're with, you will let them know things. Yep. You you won't just have them walking around looking crazy, sounding crazy, whatever. You will let them know, and especially if they do something to you, mm-hmm. I'm gonna definitely you gonna hear about it. What's that? What's I'm, I'm, I'm getting better about not drawing it out so long. Uh huh. <laughs> Cause I could go. I'm just t- well, I could. Mm. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I'm working on it. Oh, let me see. <laughs> oh Lord. Um, the man. I can only be me. Speaking up for myself. What she you said. Know? And I know it's a fine line. They say that, you know, you take the man's lead and, you know, women talking back and all that. But I don't, that don't, that don't sit right with that, though. <laughs> um, am I a child? Yeah, I, yeah, like, I understand that. And I definitely think that, you know, if your man, you know, can lead. Yeah, I think that it is the man's job. But I'm saying, like, speaking up for myself, like, you got some facts wrong or you misunderstood what I was saying. You know, and yeah, I'm going to, you know, I'm going to correct you. And I don't care, no matter who you are. Like, yeah, I butt heads, I butt heads, yeah. I butt heads quite a few in my life with a few males. I'm not going <laughs> but, uh, but, yeah, um, to. I definitely have. Oh, yeah. God. Like, you know, and I, I try not to be mouthy about it, but at the same time, I can't sit back and just let somebody have a wrong assumption about me. Like, if you took something wrong, I'm going to make you understand no what i was saying you know like i gotta work on my speed like no you know <laughs> but, like no but what i was saying <laughs> that's not what i was saying like you missed the point somewhere let's go back down this what i was and then it always turns into you know like i don't know like it just turns into crazy talk like you know you get hype and stuff and then it goes sideways and Sometimes I might be a couple miles away, man. Let me out the car. I don't, no, I don't care. I'll let me out the car. I'm getting out. Got time for this boy? <laughs> oh no, I ain't getting out the car. <laughs> Years ago, it, it's a, you know. I mean, well, it, Janissa, it, it, it's the hopes of them saying, "No, you ain't getting out this car." You know, you just mad oh, got the car doors. Now if they call you bluff and be like, "All right, you like shit." <laughs> A Jedi mind trick. Okay, I got you. I got you. <laughs> <laughs> but I've definitely been called on the bluff. Boy, get out! I'm like, fuck. Oh. <laughs> well, I'm like, I was just joking. Hey, I'm not going. You just, just drop me off where you need to drop me off because I'm not getting out. You got to physically come drag me out of this vehicle because I'm not getting out. I got to prove a point. <laughs> Even that can happen. <laughs> I got to prove a point. I've I've had uh. I've had somebody jump out of the car. Oh my god! And, and yeah, he got well. Yeah. <laughs> wow. I did. I did go. I left him, but then I went. I was like, man, all right, let me go back. That's funny. Yeah, I never. Yeah, that that was usually usually with me. It's usually with the brothers or something like that. Mm-hmm. Never. Only one time in my past life that I got out, but. Uh, mm-hmm. Yeah. Usually, I like to talk. You know, you gotta get your brothers all hyped and stuff. You know, I don't know. It's my little naughty sister thing. <laughs> ah, that's funny. Yeah. <laughs> I, I feel you on everything you said. Um, as far as like letting your man now, if you let your man leave, but there's also don't blind. I don't believe in blindly following anybody. Oh no, what she said. My man or not, I don't care how good of a leader he is. I'm not going. Um, I'm not going blindly. No, follow not you. blind. No, no, no. I'm not, nah. Some people just be like, oh, blunt, nah, nah, nah. Nah. I, I, I just see where I'm going first. I, I can't, I can't just be, yeah, just out there blind. Um. So yeah, I yeah, can only, yeah. Be, I can only be me, and I'm not gonna blindly follow anybody. What she said? Times ten, times a hundred. Mm-hmm. To get that, no. Not gonna happen. No, 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 no. Mm-mm. No, and definitely, you don't just sit there and blindly. <laughs> Excuse me. Blindly follow anybody because people are good at um, putting up a front, so you don't really know nobody's real intention. So heck mm-hmm. no. What she said. Right. Blindly follow nobody who does that. And, right. And, and okay. I'm not like I'll say it a million and one times, but you know, 
this the feminist movement, but I am not a feminist at all. <laughs> I'm not a feminist. I'm not. I'm not. Because men are powerful, especially our black men. So, you know, no, I'm not I'm not gonna ever downplay them. But yeah, I'm not gonna just blindly follow either because actually if your man is a good man and a good leader, he breaks down the process to you anyway. So you don't have to blindly follow. He so won't anybody expect you yeah, anybody expects you to blindly follow, then something ain't right with that because no, nah, you're not mm -hmm. about to program me. <laughs> what she said, right. Yeah. He won't he, if he's a good man, he won't expect you to blind. Exactly. He will. He will know when you're like, hold up, baby. Mm. Right. He'll be like, okay, okay. Yeah. Because I, I feel like this a, a good man, a, a, a real. I don't even know if I want to say real man, cause, eh, but he's not gonna ask that of you. He don't. Right. He don't. He don't want a dummy. Right. He, he wants somebody who's strong as well beside him. Not right. some little fool who's just going, oh, whatever you say, whatever you say. Like, nah. <laughs> oh, yeah. What she said? I can't believe nobody they even want me to be like that. Heck, no, not at all. What? No. Please, are you crazy? It's situations where Red God look at me like, you got this. And I'll be like, I sure do. <laughs> <laughs> I sure do. <laughs> then it's times where he like, I'll handle it because he know how I can get. He can be more diplomatic about stuff. I'm more straightforward. Like, oh, God, what's going on? <laughs> what you trying to pull? He knows how to be more, you know, professional. Right. I can be professional when I need to be, but if it's a situation, he can talk professional in the situations where we may be out in the street where it can get street, but he knows how to still. Right. Whereas me, I'm like, oh, you want to see that side of me? Okay, <laughs> right. let me show you. <laughs> what she said. I'll explain later. Anybody want to film or whatever? <laughs> hey, I'll speak up about it. Like, I ain't got no problem. Yeah. You know, where he's more like, hey, you know, we got to, you know. Right. Not so much an image to maintain, but we can lose our business or we can lose more than what they have to lose. People try to bring right. you in and stuff, whatever. And it's like, you know what? Whereas me, I'm like, hey, I'll explain it later. <laughs> what you saying, right? Me, yeah, that, must, that must be in the family a little bit, cause uh, yeah, I, <laughs> I'm like, let's get to it. We'll talk about. It. Look, I'll break every. I'll write it down for you if you want me to. Mm -hmm. I'll type it like, but hey, what did you say? <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. I can only be me with that. I'm, I, you know, I, I yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's what my son don't know about that gas station. You know, you talking about I'm saying really, like you don't know something. It was about to go there. It was about to. <laughs> right. But, trying to, you trying to be a good example. I'm yeah, trying. you got me, you know? <laughs> yeah. So what else you got for the men? Um, let me see. Uh I can only be me. Um, I'm not gonna cater to you. Uh-huh. Sorry. I, I, will, I will do for my man. Um, I'm pretty sure he's happy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he's content. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna be like your servant, your maid, your you know. Yeah, no. Your your personal chef. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> nah, I can't. I, I can only be me, and I. I, I, I feel like. If we're doing now, if I'm not really doing anything, I feel like that's a little different. You know what I mean? But I'm 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 working as much as you. I'm you know contributing. You know, because you contribute in different ways. But if you're contributing, I, no, I'm not going. I ain't right. gonna be doing. I ain't gonna have your slippers waiting at the door. Right. A hot meal waiting every night when you right. come home. Right. Uh, a bubble bath. Nah, that. I, <laughs> That's too much. <laughs> I can't. Uh, now, nah, look, every maybe every blue moon, like for an anniversary or you know your birthday, because I, I believe in um, I like to try to cook for you know people's birthday. You know, mm -hmm. like well, like my family. You know, my 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 husband, his birthday, I try to get up cook breakfast for him and stuff. But I mean, it ain't gonna be every day. <laughs> Shoot, I still I still on breakfast before work from like <laughs> <laughs> at least a year ago. <laughs> what she said, that's their favorite thing to say. Mm, cook, I, need to go. I don't know what to tell you. That's my favorite. <laughs> I don't know what I, 
Look, I didn't tell everybody. I don't know what to tell y'all because once Jenna turned three, that baby can walk, talk, and shit in the toilet. I don't know what to tell y'all. Y'all gonna be mad at me. <laughs> y'all are. They're yeah. gonna be so mad at me. Like they're gonna be so mad. <laughs> I don't blame you. I, I, don't know, I don't know to tell my grandbaby coming. My mom love you. Mm-hmm. I love you, but um, <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> Grandma has a life. I, like I have a what? Yeah. Like you said, I love love them, love them to death. Oh my goodness. Anytime, I, anytime I could spend time with 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 the grandbaby, I'm down for it. But at mm-hmm. the same time, like you said, <laughs> Grandma has a life. Grandma has stuff to do. Yeah, I don't. I got, I got you though. But if you need me, I got you. But I can't. I, ain't, I'm, I'm not that grandma. Oh, bring her over every day, every weekend, every, every you know, every moment you get. Uh, I love you, but yeah, I'm, I'm only 42. I'm like, I'm still, yeah. I was trying to explain to my granddaughter like I'm a young grandma. <laughs> <laughs> you know, but I I get it. At seven, yeah, forty two yeah. is like really. I mean, at forty a seven, to a seven year old, forty two is like oh my goodness. Yes, <laughs> like you're so <laughs> old. But mm, I'm a young grandma. I'm like you're a girl. At, most grandmas are not as young as me. <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah, this whole generation now. Our grandmoms <laughs> is different than the grandmoms now. They sure are. Yes, we are. We got to be. I think we should. I'm I'm glad that we are changing that narrative as grandmas and yeah. as grandparents because we need to like yeah ain't no candy that, dishes what you talking about right. like some leftover pizza <laughs> <laughs> candy what she said <laughs> right yeah, I, no I don't have none of that <laughs> I got this Reese cup I opened you can have the other one <laughs> I did look digging in the bottom of my pr- girl I know I got something in here I don't know, I don't know how I look I don't know how long it's been in here, but <laughs> yeah, it's dumb, dumb, dumb. Oh man, I don't know. Let me see. Wrap it up for the men. I can only be me. Um, ah, shoot. I don't know. I mean, everything really. In all honesty, <laughs> it's really everything. Okay, well, I mean, I can only get be me. I don't. I don't get bent out of shape. Like if uh. Like I, I don't really lay I don't lay in the bed and cry over arguments or uh, oh, yeah. you know, somebody flirting with you or whatever. I don't I'm like, you know, I mean I don't now I it it, it, I, it will stay in my head and at that moment I might be like, Yeah, like that bitch that was mm, do you wanna be all you know, and it's like what? When did that happen? You know when it happened. <laughs> When we were standing right in that line, <laughs> I had the bag of sour cream chips. I had handed to the cashier. That's when she hadn't looked over. Then you had looked over. <laughs> you know, but I, at the moment, I don't get denied nice shape, but it's like I'll use it as a weapon, like later, you know? <laughs> and not really care. Like, it's crazy because, like, no, I really don't care. I know that it wasn't really nothing, but this is a chance for me to, you know, it's some ammo right now. That's all. <laughs> like, I don't get all like, oh my god, I can't believe he said, oh no, oh my god, I'm so upset, I can't eat, I can't, no, I'm hungry, I'm going to eat. <laughs> right, what she said, oh yeah, it, 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 not too many things take this appetite away. <laughs> right. I don't eat, it ain't even too many things that, I'm like, oh, I can't eat, I can't sleep. Like, <laughs> Shoot, I'll be knocked out. <laughs> what she said. <laughs> oh god. Oh, oh man. man. All um, right. Well, until next time, this has been What She Said right here on RedMediaRadio.com. I'm your host, Latif, and owner of Anaj Health and Beauty. You can find me on Facebook at INOJ Health and Beauty. And that's where also you can find the, What She Said, the card game. The card game for a woman, about woman, invented by a woman. We have our lovely co host, Ms. Janisa, co owner of Student Apparel. Love yourself. Uh, you can find student on YouTube, Google, social media, search student apparel, and at www.stuenxproducts.com. Of course, you know you can find me right here every Saturday at 7 p.m. on redmediaradio.com for what she said. And check us out on YouTube Thursdays. All right. Until next time, it's five out. The Ethereal Collection. I know you're up there. I can feel you now. I know that you're afraid. You're afraid of us. You're afraid of change. I don't know the future. 
I didn't come here to tell you how this is going to end. I came here to tell you how it's going to begin. I'm going to hang up this phone, and then I'm going to show these people what you don't want them to see. I'm going to show them a world without you. The Ethereal Collection, the fashion line inspired by Red Media Radio.